your first alert weather. All right, good morning everyone. Connor Knuckles filling in for Jeff Roper here. Here's a quick look at our Vipercast radar. Not a lot of activity going on, but it is going to pick up. So let's go ahead and so take a look at what's going to happen later on in the day and later on in the week. So Monday mornings are coming in. Monday mornings are coming in. Now we're in the afternoons. Now take a look at this. So look at my other shoulder here. See this right here? This is going to come right down here and then it's just going to leave. Now watch this. There we go. There it comes and there it goes. It comes and it's gone and it's going to be gone by 10 a.m. on Wednesday. So we have a little precipitation that's going to be flooding our way, but it's going to be gone clearing up for Thanksgiving weekend. So if you have some of those unique Thanksgiving traditions like our question of the day that involve you going outside, share that with us and enjoy it while you can. Uh, OK, let's go ahead and take a look at the rain tracker. This is the this is also really good news here. 10% chance of rain on Friday and Saturday. Saturday. So we're not going to have any rain, hopefully, uh, and which is nice. That's how exactly that's exactly how you want to spend your Thanksgiving day weekend, isn't it? And so enjoy it. And temperatures right now mostly in the 20s have a couple of teens still in the mountain communities. All this is going to warm up into the 40s here later today. Uh, here we go. Let's go ahead and go around the horn. So 48 in McCammon and a low of 25, 46, 23 in Soda, 45, 25 in Lava Hot Springs, 45, 22 in Montpelier and 49, 25 out in Afton and 46, 19 all the way out there in Pinedale. OK. Du Bois, 39, 21 is your high and low for the day. St. Anthony, 42, 21 as well. That's the same for Rexburg and Ashton. Uh, 44, 22 for Driggs, 44, 24 in, out in Jackson. Uh, in the parks, 40, 19 and then 39, 20 for Island Park. When we get to the mountain communities, 45, 17 in Stanley, 46, 20 in Chalice, Ketchum, 40. 22 for you guys 52 21 in salmon that's the high for the whole region right now so nice work salmon staying warm up there 42 21 in Mackey and then 39 21 in Arco and then when we get down around the reservoir 45 22 here in Aberdeen 49 30 in Pocatello 45 24 at Blackfoot 43 21 all the way up there in Rigby 44 24 in Idaho Falls and 49 29 here by my knee in Burley now let's go ahead and take a look at our eight day forecast. We have some nice partly cloudy skies coming in for your Thanksgiving weekend for 34 and 16 by Wednesday and 38 23 on Turkey Day there. We have those 10% chances of rain there Friday and Saturday, but I should not uh, be a worry for too many people. 45 on Sunday and 47 to kick off your next week in Idaho Falls. Pocatello. 49 today, your high in Pocatello. That's going to drop all the way to 36 by Wednesday, and then it'll heat back up to 42 for your turkey day, and then 50 to kick off your next week. Now, when we get up over to Rexburg, 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 41, 21, 33, 12, and 36, 20 to get into your turkey day there, and then you're going to be in the low 40s going all the way into next week. When we get to Blackfoot, 44, 23. Tuesday in Blackfoot on your turkey day. You got 40, 23 and then pair of fours on Friday and Saturday. And again, partly cloudy skies. It's going to be pretty decent out. So if you want to do a few activities, just bundle up if you're going outside to do those. Um, Wednesday in Salmon, 38, 16. And then you guys heat up to 50 post turkey day when everyone's recovering from the food comas. And then you hit 51 by Sunday and then you're going to be in the mid 50s to kickstart your next week. Um, when we get to Jackson, Jackson 48 and a little windy today. And you guys have some snow coming in tomorrow. 42, 16 on Tuesday for you guys, but uh, shouldn't be snowing on your turkey day though. 36, 16 right there. 20% chance for, for some precipitation on Friday and then pair of fours for to wrap up the weekend there. And now for Jeff Roper's question of the day. What's your unique Thanksgiving tradition? Call his Hollaback number at 208-534-9957. To you, Dylan. All right, thank you, Connor. And 